Ian's uh, email uh, this game thanks to Keymailer um, and I was actually initially going to publish this publish it as soon as I had um, done the playthrough however I had some trouble with my um, switch so it had to be postponed nevertheless I believe I do owe the game um, the coverage um, we are diving into a um, game that offers us more than one ending from what I've read and um, that seems to be quite immersive and those who know me will also know that <clears throat> I love immersive games and I'm, uh... Oh. And I'm just looking forward to this. So, thank you to Sometimes You Publishers for the opportunity, and shout out to the dev Noskov Sergei for the game. Let's jump into it. Oh. I can jump. Items, I see. It's a bit very pixely on my end, more than expected. Um, and I'm worried that it's from me not being able to. Control it properly. So I'm playing this on the Switch. Um, be useful. when it comes to these controls, so I apologize in advance. Oh, 
need something to tear the planks. Maybe another plank. It's locked. Hmm. So I think I'd feel much more comfortable playing this, um, on a PC, personally, because I grew up using mouse and keyboard more than a controller, but nevertheless, I'm here for the gameplay and not the controller play, I guess. If I could English only. Who turned off the TV? Hmm. A lot of smelly poo. There we go. Settling at all. Hmm. I realize as I go along that this is going to be terrifying. Do I jump out? Or do I stay in the spooky building? I mean, it did say follow the lights, and technically, the light was outside. Can I jump out? No, I cannot. This is good to know. Locked. Let's see. You always have a choice. Go out into the light or stay in the dark. Okay. Why am I here? And why is it so... I don't like this. When you understand the order, the images will give you an answer. A plane. Plane 7. I will write that down. Man, this is some apocalyptic setting. We need a code. Okay. So there's definitely that nice light shimmer here that when you, um... Look at the picture. You know, like, oh, I can interact with this or I can look at this. Whoa. 
good idea to check this wardrobe. Okay. Lane 7. This is not something we can interact with. We all deserve it. Wi Fi? I don't think Wi Fi is my biggest concern right now. Although. heck saving point and a key key from basement oh no <laughs> Is everyone? What happens if I just leave? And which basement? The basement of this creepy ass looking school? Or the basement of this creepy ass looking house? And is this place even open? Locked. Good. run. so far, but I'm getting vibes that I don't feel too comfortable about right now. And another picture. It doesn't help me. for something else 
home. Oh. So we're talking like... I'm gonna guess nuclear testing and such. Because this place actually looks like it's... Oh my god. Like it has been nuked. Not directly, but like it was in proximity of... Ow. Of a door slapping me in the face. Uh, in the... Hey, Rudy. Oh. The call from the ministry was like a bolt from the blue. For the past few seconds, the brain refuses to believe what, what has been said, but recognition and horror come slowly. However, the emotions should be held inside so that one can keep calm and have a clear mind man managed have a clear mind my bad management is good now i can guess why and everything rests on our shoulders we have to make a momentous decision as soon as possible More keys? It doesn't tell me, what, tell me what kind of keys those are. I know the first floor had a couple of places that was really, um... Um... Uh, that were locked up? Hmm... It seems really nice so far though, I'm liking it. So it's really a, a game about exploring. Oh. No electricity. There's no way I can get electricity into this place, is there? Ugh. Is there? scream. Hope I don't. Okay, so we've got a perfect circle. Admittance commission. We don't have a lot of pictures. Nabuchalsia? Maybe? Die? P something. Nabucha. Mm. I don't know what that means. I know how to read Cyrillic a little bit, but not enough to. Uh, but I don't know Russian enough to be able to. You know, 
figure out anything clever. Oh, got another picture. House eight. Okay. And and what a house and oh, this is the place from outside. So we've got seven, eight, and four. on the wall. Что? Что? Something pretty to uh, something work. Corpus, corpus Corpus three? Maybe this was a school. I mean yeah, no shit, Sherlock, this could have been a school, but like Corpus sounds very school like. Mainly because it's a Latin word. So, body, I believe. It's kind of like building number one, body building number one. What's here? Anything we can interact with? Doesn't look like it. Let's find that room with the wardrobes. It was here, wasn't it? Four, maybe seven or eight. I know how to look around to an 11 subtitles target point 10 select is 5 so 5 is jump uses 3 okay okay I think plane is last, I think. I think, because...
I think I've tried them all, but... Oops. understand the order the images will give the answer hmm. so I think seven's the last because it's like there is a house there's a plane there's a house there's a house on water um Plane shows like, oh my god, that thing looks like a face. That is a face and it's terrifying. So I think the plane is the last thing, so basically the last thing before the war, basically. If that makes sense. Um, have a choice go out into the light or stay in the dark are these the endings it described well I guess let's stay here for now that even means. That's where I started. I have no clue what I'm doing. Oh, my goodness. Oh, but I'm also... I'm struggling a bit with the controls personally, so I'll have to, um, I'll have to switch out the, um, I'll have to actually get extensions for my controller, because I can't, I can't seem to, um, move nicely, which kind of bothers me. Um, that being said, I'm 30 minutes in and I feel a little tense. I'm a little curious as to how much I'll find out what the heck happened in this area. Um, and there's gotta be, be more and there's gotta be so much to it. Um, and this is something I wanna share with others, like the full playthrough. So I'll get uh, my controller thing fixed and I'll see if I can, or heck, maybe I'll buy it for a PC and make it easy on myself. Um, 
that being said, um, this is the first few uh, minutes of In the Rays of Light. And yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to dive deeper into it by uh, Sergei, Sergei Noskov. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. Um, yes, thank you for watching. Make sure to, if you enjoyed this, make sure to click the like button and make sure to sub. Um, I want to be putting out more short game peaks in the near future. And uh, make sure to tick on the notification bell, bell so that you know when the next um, video comes out. Stay safe, stay cool, see you next time. Bye-bye.